Hey guys, thanks. We're joined by Caesar of Gamer Sensei, who is a Fortnite coach and pro player. How are you doing, Caesar? I'm doing well. How are you doing? Pretty good. Should we hop right in and yeah, get to it? Yeah, let's get straight to it. Awesome. Okay, so where do you want to land? Uh, I mean, risky wouldn't be a bad shout. Links or pleasant? Okay, so I must forewarn you, I don't know what I'm doing. It's okay. Sorry, don't worry okay. <laughs> No, like, I truly don't know what I'm doing. Like, you've never played the game ever? I've seen it. So how did you first get started in Fortnite coaching? So I got officially, like, partnered with like my organization and they kind of had like some kind of deal going on with Gamer Sensei and they were like hey so like we were like we have this gig with them that you basically coach other players like would you guys want to do it and we were like basically just like yeah like why not like why wouldn't you know it's it's a good thing to kind of do it helps other people out and it was kind of cool to meet all these other people so um I've been doing it for roughly like three months three to four months now actually have you coached other games before or uh, no 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 this is actually the first one so because like I actually went like professional in this game so like I'm sponsored by the team by sure, Gangstars, sure, sure. Um, that they basically hooked me up with Gamer Sensei, and like through it, that's like my first, honestly, everything that I've ever done regarding coaching. Yeah. Which one am I? You're the fish one. That's terrible. What's like the thing that you have to coach people most in? Like, what's the hardest thing for people to do? Uh, so, this, so what separates this from other battle royales is the building aspect. Okay. So, most people that come to me are struggling with building or struggling with like how to like take like aggressive approaches to other players, just building typical structures, um, just like what's the proper way to push someone, what's like the incorrect way to push someone. What is it about Fortnite that makes it resonate with pretty much every single group? Like I hear about it all the time on the subways and stuff like that. I guess it's just the fact that like it's literally on every single platform so it's almost like you can't escape the game. It's also insanely optimized as opposed to like PUBG and right. H1Z ones. So, like it also makes it like that much better. It makes it that much easier for people to play it on like lower end like PCs and you know like it's on right. and, you know, right. it's available on Android. So I think that's why like it makes it like that much more popular that like literally anyone can play it. Press Z and it should pull up like a wall, right? Yeah. And then you hit left click. Uh huh. And there you confirmed a wall. So that's like your wall. You could use that for like cover someone's shooting at you. <gasps> There's someone in front of me. Where? Is that you? This is me. Yeah, this is me with the wing. Oh. <laughs> Does Gamer Sensei have like other coaches as well, or are you? Oh yeah, huh? they're like yeah. There's a, a wide variety of like coaches, like whether it be for Fortnite, whether it be for other titles like Overwatch, Counter Strike, League of Legends. Like they have a wide variety of coaches in other game titles as well. There's a shotgun here for you that you can take. Right I here. I feel like I'm your useless sidekick that's not bringing anything <laughs> no, no, to you're the fine. game. So one thing I always tell people is to like make sure that they don't like fully destroy trees. So like just leave oh, it like a one okay. hit. So like obviously like if you destroy it, you got like, the whole animation of like you destroying and people know someone's there. That makes so sense. So you could get kind of like in the habit of like just leaving them like one. Oh, I messed up. I'll take <laughs> that's a terrible example. But like a good example setting is like just leaving it one hit so people don't know you're obviously there. If we win <laughs> our first game, I'll be, I'll be pretty stoked. <laughs> <laughs> Unlikely, because I'm gonna die the second I see someone because I can't build. Now I thought I would be battling people and shooting people. This is what we're doing. There's a lot of people right here. That's why I'm bringing you here. Oh. Uh -huh. How about I let you go first and get shot, and then I'll be the superhero after the game? So you are rescuing. Okay. 23, 23. Okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, you patted out, patted out. I see it. He's at doghouse. Oh, he's on the roof. On the roof. Yeah, I'm trying to. Walk. I am not able to build. I'm trying to jump to. Ah, dang it! I was trying to. <laughs> I was trying to put up the wall because I'm used to. I'm used yeah, to console. This is hard. Someone oh, they actually shot me. You're downed right now, so like if. I'm gonna have to kill these people first before I can actually pick you up because they're gonna push off that. Oh, this is a terrible way to die. I think at this point you might want to use yeah, your shotgun, just rush up to him. There you go. Oh, gosh. Engagement. Right behind you. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is brutal. How <laughs> good? 14th place. <laughs> hey, 14's not so bad for first it's time. Not. I'm in 18th place. How many people were playing? Uh, since they were playing duos, there's 50. So teams of two, so it's 100 people. I'm a legend. <laughs> 